We saw that two sets are equivalent if their cardinal numbers are the same. But when are two sets equal? Two sets are equal when they have precisely the same elements. You will soon know what I mean when I say precisely. Consider these two sets. Set E has 1, 2 and 3 as its elements and set F also has 1, 2 and 3 as its elements. Since they have the same elements, we can say that set E is equal to set F. Now consider two other sets. Set G with 3, 9 and 11 as its elements and set H with 11, 3 and 9 as its elements. We can see that both the sets have the same three elements 3, 9 and 11. So set G is equal to set H. From this example, we could say that as long as the elements in the sets are the same, the order does not matter. Now look at these two sets. Set I consists of 4, 5 and 8. Set J consists of 4, 5, 8 and 9. If you observe, you can see that both the sets have 4, 5 and 8 as their elements. But J also has 9, which set I does not have. This means that I is not equal to J. Remember, for sets to be equal, their cardinal numbers also have to be the same. In this case, N of I is not equal to N of J, which makes the sets unequal. When I say precisely, this is what I meant. Same elements and the same number of elements. Now look at these two pair of sets which are equal. Cardinal number of E is equal to the cardinal number of F. Cardinal number of G is equal to the cardinal number of H. Remember, two sets that are equal will always be equivalent. Now look at sets E and H. They are equivalent, but since the elements are not the same, they are not equal. But now look at sets E and F. They are equivalent, but they are also equal. This tells us that two sets that are equivalent may or may not be equal. Remember, two sets are equivalent if they have the same cardinal number. And two sets are equal if they have the same cardinal number and the same elements.